Anyway, today I am heading to Orlando for Alex and I's four year anniversary, so I'm going to begin packing. I forgot that I put my bag in my suitcase, which I can't find now. So that's gonna be an adventure for later Michaela to figure out. But for now, I'm gonna pack, I'm gonna watch some Hulu, and I'm also gonna do this face mask on my nose because I can like feel it's gross. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. And yeah, I'll keep you updated on the whole bag suitcase situation though when I get to it. <laughs> for this morning and now I just ate a cake pop. It's called like the Sahara Sands or Sahara Desert Cake Pop. It's really good. It's vanilla cake, white chocolate, and then like cinnamon sugar on it. It's really good. So that's my breakfast for the day. I might go to Starbucks. But um, we're also trying to find Alex food because they're not serving breakfast anywhere around here and all the places that serve lunch and dinner are currently closed. Like they're not open yet. So we're trying to figure out that situation because anyone that knows Alex knows that food comes first. So we're trying to figure that out. Um, but yeah, that's the update. We have a fast pass for Dinosaur in Dino Land. And then after that, we're heading over to um, Epcot to get some snacks, get some drinks. So, but yeah, I'm honestly there for the giant pretzel and the popsicles and the flavored popcorn. So I'm down. But we're going to try and find Alex some food. And then we'll probably just walk around for a little bit. It's already getting really, really hot. So we're not going to make this visit here very long. But yeah, that's the update. Leave me alone. He's like, oh, I'm on to something. Let's walk. We gotta go. It's not we that gotta go. On the other side of this. All right. <laughs> I told you it's a mission. I'm not kidding when I say that. Look at him. He has no idea I'm not behind him. Wait. Flying, flying. If anyone that knows me, this is really fast walking, almost running for me. He's flying. Oh, I smell the food too. Oh my god. that kid is. Look how happy. <laughs> What'd you get? Wow. <laughs> I got coffee and the same thing he did. Good job, babe. Nope. 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 Okay. Okay. So a 
update. We are no longer in Animal Kingdom. We pretty much, I canceled our two other fast passes. And now we're in Disney Springs. I've done some shopping already. And now we're gonna head to the Happy Hound for Josie. Obviously, I'm thinking of my puppy while I'm here. So we're gonna see if we can find her something cute at the Happy Hound. Obviously thrilled. Yeah, let's go to the Happy Hound. <laughs> Look how cute! Good, how are you? What does it say? Squirrel. <laughs> oh my god. It says wiggle butt. None. We have to get her the wiggle butt. What is this, a scarf? Yeah, she's a little bandana. She's gonna tear it apart. Okay, fine. Oh, that'll be annoying real quick. Well, this one has a little one in it. Oh, there's a sponge. Better, better. Okay, Alec wouldn't let me buy Joe's anything at the dog stand because he made a good point that she would just rip it to shreds anyway. So, didn't get anything for her, but I might get her a stuffed animal when we come here later today, just from like the Disney store because her bear that she has now, she's kind of uh, crushing it. So, she's gonna need a replacement pretty soon. But yeah, we're gonna head out of Disney Springs now because it's wicked hot. And we're gonna head back to the hotel, grab some lunch, hang by the pool for a little bit, and then head to Epcot to hang out there. So that's the update, and we'll catch you guys back at the hotel. <laughs> there wasn't a pin for the umbrella. So Alex used a stick. <laughs> It is now almost five o'clock and we've been in Epcot kind of walking around. Right now we're in USA Pavilion. So we're kind of just chilling. Um, I was getting really, really hot and overheated. So I had to sit inside. I had a popsicle and then I came inside. But we've been doing good.
rematch. <laughs> Take a little bit back. back. Yeah, come stand on that side. Look, the dog. Try it. Oh, I fucked up. Yep. It's all my hopes, dreams, and aspirations right there. Just a look of pure defeat. <laughs> You're gonna be out of money real quick if you keep this up. Look, she's already yeah, she's already out. Takes credit card though, so you know, we're good. Good morning. I look. But I thought I'd show you what I got at Disney Springs last night very quickly and then kind of give a small little update before we get the day going. I don't know why I saw it facing towards the window. Hang on. There we go. Well, that's crooked, but you know, it's fine. First thing I got, I went to Sephora. I got dry shampoo and triple sec from dry bar. Just the little travel sizes because, yeah. Next, I also got a travel size of the um, First Aid Beauty Face Cleanser. I got a travel size just because I got another face cleanser. But this is my go-to one, so just in case the other one doesn't work out, I at least have somewhat of a backup. Next thing... I got it's the Sephora um, Hydrate um, Face Primer. I used the Tarte Base Tape Primer for the winter and it worked really well because it's very hydrating. But then it got to the point where it was too hydrating for now in the summer and it started making my skin very oily very quickly. So this one is still hydrating because my skin is dry but my skin produces oil very quickly. So this one's more mattifying then oil producing yeah last thing I got is the um, youth to the people kale green tea spinach vitamins superfood cleanser I've heard really really good things about this it comes with a pump and this is what the bottle of it looks like it is a glass bottle but it smells really good. I've heard a lot of really, really good things about this because it's not super strong, but it does act like it is. So, I'm excited to try that out. Went into a couple of different stores, but the only place I got something else from is from American Threads. So, and there I got... First thing I got from American Threads is this little crop top with one shoulder. I just got it in black. They had a whole bunch of different colors, but black's always my go-to color for stuff, so. Next thing I got is another little shirt. This is a little tank top with spaghetti straps. And I liked it because it had an undershirt with it, too. So, we love the support. Last thing I got from American Threads is this snakeskin skirt. This denim skirt that's like a teal snakeskin pattern. They had it in like the original white and black, but I thought this color was very different and unique. So, got that. But that is everything I got from Disney Springs. I forgot my employee ID for Coca-Cola, so I couldn't go in and get anything from Coca-Cola. 
I mean, I could, but. So I'm gonna go in there later today and pick up some stuff to take home. And then I think that's the last place I wanted to go into in Disney Springs. But I'm gonna fix this and we're gonna head to Magic Kingdom. once again and we just did buzz and the people mover we have a fast pass to pirates which is going on now but I wanted to try and get this which I did because the other day they were sold out of the two things I wanted to try but they had it today this is the wishes granted donut for the new movie Aladdin it's a glazed donut with gold sugar cotton candy and a chocolate square so I'm gonna munch on this really fast and then we have to go ahead to our fast pass so that's the quick update see y'all later Jones. It's the rum they want. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so it has been much, much, much later now. Um, it's been a couple hours actually. Uh, but we left Magic Kingdom as you guys saw and we headed to Disney Springs so we can go to the Coca-Cola store and get everything I wanted from there. Now after it kind of showering, relaxing a little bit, watching TV because I had a massive migraine. I still kind of do, so I'm not feeling that great. But um, we are at Shake Shack now getting some dinner, and then we're going to head, and then we have a reservation to do an escape room. Hopefully no one else is doing it with us. I checked the reservation, and it's so far only us in like, the seat, in like the seating queue or whatever. So, fingers crossed, no one signs up for it. But yeah, I'm just waiting for our food to get here. I got a cheeseburger and a vanilla shake. The Alex got one of their spicier sandwiches. I don't remember what it's called. A smoke shack. That's what he got, and then we each got fries. So, we're just hanging out, waiting for the food, and then we'll do a quick update right before the escape room. So it is now 8.40 and we are about, we're about 30 minutes away, I was doing the math. We're about 30 minutes away from doing our escape room. We're in the parking lot now, so we have time to go check in and everything. Again, no one's in our party, but it seems busy, so hopefully. I can't record anything in the escape room. Obviously, it kind of defeats the whole purpose of it being a surprise, but um, yeah, that's the update we'll see you after we'll let you know if we escaped or not probably not because last time we only had 10 seconds to spare but we got out so that's all that matters we'll see you later so it's been a hot minute 
I didn't finish the vlog last night because we escaped the first room we did, which was the special ops room. But then we left and they were offering a discount if you either signed up for another game after or bought like gift cards so you can come back. So we had nothing else to plan for our anniversary yesterday. So we just did another game. We ended up doing the hardest one, which was Prison Break, and we also escaped that one. So now we have three games that we have escaped from and zero. We haven't. So we're on a roll. It's basically us. Like, it's a pattern. It's us. Like, we're just that good, don't you think? Oh, yeah. It's gotta be. <laughs> so, but those are really fun. So, I, like, we ended up getting out at, like, around midnight from the last game. So, I didn't vlog because we didn't plan on doing that. So, but, yeah, that was super fun. We did that. Went back to the hotel. Watched um, Captain America Winter Soldier for a little bit. Fell asleep. Woke up. Left. And then we went to breakfast at Kiki's down here at the Mall of Millennia. And then we also just walked around the mall. I got a couple things. I'll do a haul of everything I got on this trip once I get home. But I got a Starbucks. I got my metal straw. And don't come for me for the plastic cup though, please. I try my best. I'm lucky I remembered the straw, to be honest. But I also got bagel bites, which I'm so excited about because I thought they discontinued them. But they had them. So had to pick up those because those haven't been around probably since like last summer like I got hooked on them last summer when I was up at school all summer and then they like took them away so I'm super excited that this place had them but we're about to hit the highway start heading home so our trip's over but it was really fun and relaxing good way to recharge and so yeah that is the vlog that is all I had for this trip um I know it's 90% of us, most of us, just like me updating and eating, but that's essentially all that we do, so, yeah. But, uh, <laughs> <Not> wrong. <laughs> that's really all that we do. So, um, yeah, I'll do a haul of everything I got on this trip once I get home, because I did do quite a bit of shopping. Ate it. Just give an update. I'm gonna start trying posting regularly now I would like to do like weekly vlogs like once a week but because I'm working it might be a little hard to do that plus my life's pretty freaking boring so if you want to see my life hit that subscribe button down below and stay tuned for more videos because I'm going to try and do it a lot more frequently now and I'll catch you guys next time